What's up, guys? It's your boy Dalton here with Jacob. Yo. And we're doing something a little special, as you can somewhat see. We have a very intriguing looking container here that Jacob will tell you more about. Yeah, so um, this was donated for us for an unboxing by Jackie. Thanks. And, and who's uh, this Jackie character? Jackie is my sister. She plays Buddy Fight with us sometimes. So, uh, And she happens to really like Tosuku. He's mm. her uh, favorite character. And in Japan, uh, they released a special set that was two different decks, much better than a typical start or trial deck, mm. right? Basically full decks. One for <coughs> Tosuku's essentially current deck, uh, Neo Dragons, but focused on Aster, which was what he used... Uh, that was in uh, Buddy Fight 100 towards the end against Purgatory Knights, which were what he used when he was evil. Um, both really interesting decks. One is very control heavy uh, mm. with pressure units, and the other one is very aggressive, getting lots of attacks in one turn. Yes, yes. Uh, so Jackie ordered one of these, mm -hmm. uh, and she said, hey, you guys can unbox it on your channel. And there's some interesting things. We got a deck for each. We got some extra goodies coming with them. Ooh. And a nice storage box to put it all in. Exactly. Uh, so do you want to get started? Would yeah. you like to do the, do the honors? Oh, I'd love of to. Breaking do... the seal? Oh, if I drink up my nails so If long. you break uh, the seal, though, be careful because you don't want to unleash Shiami Ghetto. Maybe I do want to unleash Shiami Ghetto. All right. Now with that off, there we are. It looks beautiful. Beautiful. So it looks like this piece just oh, oh, of course slides off. Slide off. Now we get to truly admire everything. Which is... So what do we got on each side? Well, you, as of right now, you, full, you get the full depiction here. A little oh. poster Jack in a sense. Jackknife and little, some Damios. A little poster action here. Sukus. And over here, uh, I see Damios. Looking like a bad mofo over here. <laughs> And a little bit more. More Tosukus. More, more Tosukus, because there wasn't tosuku. enough. 7.8 out of 10. Then, then you got Astro over here, looking like a chill dog. That's, you know? I gotta admit, I'm not the biggest Jackknife fan. That's a pretty nice looking Astro, though. Yeah. <laughs> That's the best Astro, absolutely. <laughs> all right, you ready to get into her, see, see, see what she's all about? Spooky. Open it. I can't wait. Ooh. All right, so right off the bat, we see the probably the best part of the decks themselves. Oh, the sleeves. Yes. <laughs> we'll get to the sleeves. Let's go through the decks first because yeah. they're shiny. All right, let's take these bad boys out. Is there anything? We'll get oh, to that like too. It. Anything else? No, anything? just oh, nope. put that back in there. <laughs> All right, so these decks uh, do come with some shiny cards. So right off the bat, we have, uh, what's his name? Hero Dragoner Jackknife. Hero Dragoner Jackknife. In, uh, I thought it was a little more green when I saw pictures of it. It's more of, it's a more teal. of like a teal, Definitely aquamarine a teal. kind of -y thing. Look at us trying to describe colors. Yes. Um, so I'm just going to pull that away. Really nice foil on it. And I like the color. Versus uh, what is uh, Damios's? We have a very dark blue here. I would say to kind of represent how he's in Darkness Dragon World now, protecting Dragon World. Very nice, very, very nice. So nice I mean, shine. While we've got their buddy rares up here showing them before we even break the decks open, we're going to talk about what they do. Yes, uh, yes. This guy, his skill on enter, it's uh, look at the top card of your deck and place it into the soul or put it in your hand. Yes. Nice, simple card. Really Thanks. great for uh, keeping your advantage going. Mm -hmm. Set up for your Asters. And then the Lord Damios himself. Basically keeps the same counter skill, but the only difference you really notice is from his call cost. Because now it's a bump, it's now a gauge, and then you also place the top card of your... No. Place nope. a card from your drop zone yep. into soul. And now it has soul guard and move. Yeah. I don't remember original Damios having move, but... No, he did not. So it's definitely a straight up upgrade. And I believe he has a bump in his stats too. I mean, uh, one gauge for all that. Yeah, because he'll want maybe three thousand, three thousand defense on the original. So yeah, nice straight up upgrade. Just honestly, straight upgrade, a straight upgrade. And uh, his counter skill, which can pop up Purgatory Knights to stand monster. it back up. Yes, yes, yep, yes, yes. A monster. Uh, you can use it on himself. Yes, pop at, least at least yeah. once. At least once. All right, you wanna 
open these up and uh, well, we'll let's eat. let's start off with Jackknife himself. We'll, we'll hold Demios off a little bit, you know. I mean, Jackknife is Tasuka's one true buddy, so it makes sense. Well, I wouldn't say his best buddy. Is it like cheating on a spouse? Like if you use a different buddy? Oh no! no Some explain, of them are explained Gal. Well, Gal's just a player. All right. Let's... All right. So I will uh, dish out the cards, and you get to. All right. So obviously we talked about the buddy rare already. Ooh, definitely a nice swirl type deal. Oh yes. But then we also have a triple rare foiling here for it. Quite nice. I do like this triple rare. It's subtle, sleek. Interesting. Very simple. It Nothing looks like uh, the deck is sorted in a way so all the shiny cards come first. Well, that's the good thing. Yeah. Good thing. All right, so uh, Hero Hi Dragoner. Hero Dragoner Jackknife. Really nice looking. Yeah, yeah. Slider. Slider. And uh, next here. we have uh, Aster. So oh, the, is this the new Aster? Yes, that is the new yes, Aster. Yes, the new Aster. What does this new Aster do, Soul Jacob? Aster is an amazing pressure unit. Um, I don't remember its cost, um, but it has two big abilities. One is, uh, if this card's on your left or right, reduce all damage you take by attacks by two, basically forcing your opponent to hit him. Mm -hmm. um, and his second skill prevents him from being destroyed by card effects and prevents all your cards on the field from having their abilities nullified, something that's getting increasingly important in the meta. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. And doesn't he also have the ability so his souls can't be dropped too? I think so. Nice. Uh, we're going off memory. Very, very good, very good. Not as cool, not as, I don't know, I prefer the Hero Dragoners. Like art. Triple rare. Yeah. Foiling. It's still hole. nice, though, and it's a really good card. Yes. Uh, so next we have uh, Star Dragoner Jackknife SD. Ooh, look at that. Another SD, because we need more SDs in our lives. And uh, there are more copies of these cards. They're just not shiny. Yeah, they're just not shiny. Um, and forgive me, I don't remember this whoa, whoa, one's whoa, name. Be before you okay. go further, what, what does this SD do? Uh, on enter, you check the top three, choose a card, put it into the soul of a card on the field. So yep. those size three drag worms, you can use more! Because now it's more consistent with this one card here. Beautiful. And so Beautiful. this next one isn't particularly flashy, but it's one of the most important cards for the deck. This is a... Uh, the searcher, correct? Yes. So if it's in the soul of a jackknife, you can pay a gauge. I think it's a life. Maybe. Maybe. Sorry, we're doing this off memory. Um, search your deck for a card with Aster in its name. Mm -hmm. Bring that a little closer. Ooh. That's good. Good card. And next we have uh, some double rares. And these are both reprints. That is uh, the original Aster. The original Aster. I don't know. I feel like this should have been a triple rare foil. Yeah, but I mean, it's, it's better than nothing. Then again, I don't like this double rare foiling. I, I like the OG ones, but... Yeah, it doesn't do it too much justice. Mm -hmm. Next, uh, another reprint, Star Guardian Jackknife. One of the harder jackknives to get, so I appreciate the fact that it's here. Again, I, I have to say, it, this doesn't do it justice. I don't know. Trip rare foilings, probably. Maybe SP. So uh, do you want me to skip the ones we've already shown off in their higher rarities, or just go through them anyways? Eh, it's up to you. All right, we'll go through them. Why not? Just show numbers real quick. So that's all the shiny stuff in the deck. All right. The so shape. what do we start off here first? Uh, uh, Hero, Hero Dragoner. Dragoner. Another three copies. Obviously. But buddy. Buddy. Of course. So it's nice that they actually give you five, which most like trial decks don't do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, so boom, there's your buddy. There's your buddy. There's your buddy. Uh, we got one more Soul Aster. It's yeah. kind of weird that they only give you two, almost like they're trying to force you to get a second one. But honestly, what are you if, talking about? Most people are probably going to get yeah, five. Get five for that beautiful buddy rear. Mm. Um, next, we got another SD, correct? Another SD. Two. two SDs. Then we got three more of the searcher. Oh, did I put the searcher? There, there it is. Go. So Search four in total. Four searchers. Nice that they give you. Need, you need to make sure you get into them quite uh, often. Next, we have a new nullify for the deck. New nullify. It's getting around a lot of monsters. Yes, this is the pay a gauge, nullify the attack, and then is it from drop zone, add a card to soul? Yeah. Yes, very good. Very good. Definitely going to be a staple for jackknife builds and probably maybe stronger builds. Hopefully maybe. when we get it, uh, it'll be like a common, so it's not too hard to get your copies. No, triple right. <laughs> Next we have their new weapon. 
Ooh. which, let's just be honest, is not that great. Well, you know, to each their own. It really yeah. depends on like how you want to go about it. Because it's really just to stand your jackknife up again and just keep going with attacks. It's probably more with the a certain impact. So almost the pretty much the entirety of the decks left are all reprints. So oh, that's um, good. I, I forget this one's name. Ah, uh, the biggest Drago Arms. Um, I can't remember. It's the rest one of them. <laughs> all I know is the biggest. Very good. If I'm correct, this is a nullify? I do not remember, honestly, at all. Or it's a monster destruction. Let us know in I the know, comments. I know it's pay a gauge for something. Another one. Another one. Mm. Another big old drag one. arms. Yes, another biggest. They have a lot of biggest. <laughs> but who's the real biggest? Um, that guy. Okay. Right up next, we got another Star Guardian Jackknife. Okay, so you have full two. Full two, which is nice, which is nice. Then we got two of the Drag Arms that gives move. It's also weird seeing some of these cards with the new backing. You know, yeah, the new I, Star Dragon World design. I really thought Bushi was going to go in a whole different way with this, keeping this border for Neo Prism, Dragons. Prism Dragons and then keep or, the old yeah. one for the Neo Dragons. But this is what they're doing. I don't know. No, I really wish I remember this guy's name. I do remember what Is he it does. A court. It begins with Q five, something. Something. Because if you have a Neo Dragon with souls, when it enters, is it gain a gauge and draw a card? Yeah. Yes. Very good. Very good. Hopefully, bring down the price a little bit. Just, just one copy of this. Just guy. one copy of that one. Don't know his name, but I remember seeing him before. I do like this art though. Much we are not art. the biggest experts on uh, Star Dragon World. Yeah. Neither of us play uh, Jackknife. I do play Dragons and Neo's Wise. So yeah, like, Dragons Wise. You play Dragons Wise. I do there know some of them. Yes. I want to say that one has to do with Gage? I cannot remember offhand. It, neither can I, but that's all right. It's more to show off these cards yeah. and see their new arts and so forth. This one's Double Attack. Well, I yeah. believe it's uh, it six, used to be a double rear. Yeah, six life or less. Discard it from soul. Give double attack. That was pay gauge. I don't. Remember. Oh, maybe, yeah, yes, I think yeah, gauge. it's pay gauge. It might also discard it. I don't think so. It, but I think it actually uh, stays. I can't remember. Oh, we know this card. I thought it was different art though. Um, luminous red. Um, oh my bad. Yes, luminous blue. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Buddy Spoiler has a different art for it. But yeah. I can't complain. I like the OG art too, but the new one would have been better. Very good card. Very good card. This one's a uh, spell nullify. Yes, because you need drag arms that nullify spells. Need spell nulls in today's game. Next, Ooh. we're into spells. Jackknife yeah. boost. Jackknife boost, right? Mm. Very good. Very good. Or no? No. Yeah. No, it's not. I'm trying. Oh, this is jackknife boost. We're so good at this. We're so good at this. We're so good at this. We're pros. We're pros. This is like a really staple jackknife card for advantage gaining. Isn't I'm... it jackknife repair? Yeah. Yeah, jackknife yeah. repair. Thank you, Christian. I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> then we got the nice combo of Earth Barrier and Proto Barrier. Yay! Where's my Mars? I want Mars. Uh, we've got some counter destruction for monsters. Yeah, there you go. There you go. We've got the second weapon of the deck. This one's nice and solid. I, I have to say, I really like this. Was uh, I believe this one was in the a double rare and in the secret pack for Aster. Um, oh, this doesn't look no like the one that you're thinking of. It looks a little shorter. No, I'm pretty sure it is the one. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it's... Uh, Let us know in the comment section below. I believe it's different. I believe, I believe it's gives different. move, and then it gives plus 1,000 power. Oh, and they must have really changed the art up. Yeah, I do. Yeah. They and really then this is interesting because I thought this was new art as well, but no. Uh, we got Radiant Punisher. Radiant Punisher! And uh, last but not least, and this one is the only card that can be used in English tournaments the flag. Ooh, there's Jack. For all you Jack lovers, or Immortusuku. It's pretty decent. So it looks in total, there's only one soul? No, there's two because there's one in common rarity in there, right? Mm -hmm. Well, really? I don't think. Oh, this is so no, this that's, is this uh, is OG. Radiant. This is OG. Yeah. So it looks like OG only has one copy in it. Guess Interesting. So. Well, I guess it's not as important now that I got the new one. Mm, it's true. True. 
but also like we said earlier you know most people in japan are buying gonna buy multiple for the shine so that basically wraps up the new star dragon world jack and hive tag let's let's get it's on pretty good let's get on into demios and all of his Purgatory demonic Knight. glory i actually used to play purgatory Knight, so this one's not gonna be too hard for me i don't know what you're talking about i don't remember you playing them Oh, excuse me. Got a little cough going on. They're kind of hard to get out of their uh, packaging. Just because the packaging is a tad bit tighter than what it should be. All right. Let's go. Obviously, you saw the buddy right already. Let's get probably a little better close up. Ooh. See fuck. Ooh. It's so nice looking. Oh, you didn't do that with a jackknife, but. I'm going to take a peek at it yeah, separately. But then you have the triple rare. I don't know That's how well it would come out on camera, but it's such like a deep blue. Yes. It's like very nice. Dark, dark ocean type blue. Start off with all the high rarity stuff. And this, the new rapier. Is there going to be a new rapier deck coming out, guys? Let us so, know. Let I didn't know. think this card was very good. It's uh, spell destruction. It's going to be... But I don't know how well it's going to work against stars because that's going to be the main thing it's going to be trying to counter. It'll be interesting. But I might have. We'd have to figure out a ruling on it. I might have chosen some different card to put in triple rear foiling, but whatever. What Next, you what you have against rapier? I don't know. Rapier man. dragon's awesome. And then the boomerang of the deck, needle claw. Mm. Ooh, quite. Yeah. Beautiful. So he synergizes beautiful. with Damios like crazy. Well, I hope so. Yeah. Yeah, if he doesn't, there we have a problem. <laughs> but I really do like this. Really story. good card, and one of the things they really needed. And now, for the death itself. <laughs> so, uh... Genocide Banasher! That name's probably going to get censored in English. Got it. Um, Kill a bunch of people, Banasha. Well, uh, in Vanguard, there was a card called uh, Genocide Jack in the early days. That mm -hmm. when Bushiro translated it in, in, into English, they uh, they called it Brutal Jack. So maybe it'll be Brutal Ooh, Punisher. I do like this foiling, though. Yeah. That's really nice looking. And, I just uh, wish it was Gal. It's a surprisingly good card, too. Well, it only costs two gauge. Two gauge. To two potentially gauge. OT if done right. Because I don't think it specifies different Purgatory Knights no, in Drop, right? it's just Purgatory Knight. You could potentially OTK a Neo's wide deck. It's pretty awesome. If... If somehow they run impacts. Yeah. That, and uh, for decks that rely on impacts, you know, uh, looking at Zeta. That that's card impact can... monsters, though. That, True. But it's, it's still it, an it impact. It still procs, doesn't it? It specifies impact when it, impact is cast. So oh. Well. It, it's probably one of those fuzzy things. One of those fuzzy things. All right. Now i got to remember which Daniels this is. Uh, this that's... looks like Inferno. Yeah. This looks like Inferno. It's hard to tell, especially since they both have new arts. Yes, they have new arts we're not familiar with. Yes, this is this is yeah. Inferno. The other one's gonna have less text on it. Mm -hmm. It's alright. I do okay I do card. I do like the new art, but again, not a huge fan of this double rare foiling. Because mm. OG foiling is better than OG OG Damios. Hopefully only has one copy in the deck, just like the OG <laughs> Aster, Aster, so we don't oh. you're on, let's be I don't honest. Know, it might not, be him that's at one. But to be honest, you're probably not going to be running this card. No, the new one's just such a great it's upgrade. Just too good, too good. Now let's let's get into everything else. Slide these guys off to the side. Slide off. Obviously, the beautiful the, shiny. The cards. buddy. The buddy. The buddy. The buddy. Because of course, because he's it's absolutely beautiful. the best card in the deck. It's beautiful. Huh? Let's go close up here. Yeah, 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 yeah. definitely yeah. needs a triple rare foiling. Definitely triple rare or that sweet buddy rare. I don't know. I think I'd be content with the four triples. triple rares and then a buddy rare. But yep. then again, everyone to each their own, you know, Makes to sense. each their own. Put that off here. I see. So we run two rapiers. Quite nice, quite nice. Because to be honest, you don't want to run too much spell now. With a triple rare foiling. Mm. I don't know, I think they did a lot better job with the triple rare foilings over here than... With the jackknife? With the jackknife ones. That's fair. Then again, I'm not a huge fan of jackknife. I've hopefully made that clear enough, <laughs> especially after he got his own world. I mean, um, arch type, and then obviously you need four of this, four of this guy until all executioners get their own version of Heaven's Sunshine. 
Call it executioners. Yeah, executioners. Yeah. Okay. Because because it's a guard. Oh right, right, right. Because it's a guardian yeah. card too. Okay, that's why I got you. And yeah. hopefully it's a darkness jangle card and just kind of go out of town with it. I was just not expecting that. So. <laughs> um, good card though. What yeah. more can you yeah, say? Yeah. Good card. If we would have gotten this in English, I'm pretty sure I would have gotten four of these just to get this card. I probably would never use this card, but that triple rare foil. Yeah. Just too good. Next card is their nullify? Yes, it is their nullify. It's basically a better inferno shield slash better sun dragon shield slash is there another shield out there that does the same thing of gain a mm. gauge in a life? Does it gain? I thought it would just gain a gauge. I'm pretty sure it's a gauge. I thought it was a gauge, but didn't require an open center or something like that. I don't remember. Because it requires you to have it's a, a good card. card. It's good, good card, good. Good card, good. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. So n next is the new weapon for the deck, which is yes. really solid. Uh, its skill is once per turn when a Purgatory Knight on your field is destroyed uh, during your attack phase. Uh, give a it gets plus three thousand power. And your weapon is six two, which is nice. Which and is you nice. get to draw a card, which has some really crazy synergy. Look at that! It only took a while, but we finally have draw power. Mm -hmm. So uh, next we get looks like some more brutal Punisher. No, genocide! Because <laughs> you know it has to be genocide for now until we get the official English English release. Oh, but that I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, I'm vibing with the pretty plain art. Next. Next, let's see here. We have, who is this crazy guy right here? Who is it? It's a size three, I don't remember who he is. It's, that's not. That's the one that reduces its size? Oof. Is this the second version of him? Is the first one in there? Yeah, it is. Um, can't remember his name. He actually was from. Uh, he was a double rare in. Uh, oh yes. DBTO two. Yes, now yeah. I remember you. I, I can't. I guess it's the same art. Yeah. Huh. I feel like Lance is in his name. Yurham Lance. No, I don't know. Maybe next. O only one of it. Next. Only one of it. And I was right. I'm giving you two of Inferno. Okay. Hmm. I don't know. I do kind of like the plane. Hey, no, then again, I never like this double rare. Next we've Four, got like, the uh, OG. OG. Beautiful, beautiful card. That was from Break to the Future and was crazy hard to find. So it's nice to was see it? a reprint. Yeah. I don't know. I guess I wasn't focused on Darkness Dragon World at the time. It was not enough Spectral Strike. Ridiculously hard to get. Look at this. We actually do get a full more. set of a uh, full set of Damios. I guess, since it's free. Darkness Dragon World still has problems. And look, another reprint! Yeah, that's a really recent one, isn't it? It's like, uh, I want to say... Uh, it was in Triple D, if anything. It's yeah. in Triple D. I want to say it's monster destruction? Like, when it's destroyed, you get to pay a cost to destroy something? Might be wrong in that, but I feel... I'm feeling it. Who knows? Who knows? Well, they hopefully know. The next oh. couple, we a lot of these were promos at one point or another. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember uh, this being a promo. That was a promo, and I believe it uh, forces the opponent to discard cards from their hand mm. when it's destroyed. That control aspect to this aggro deck, because you need that. Max, is this the card that yes. I think it, it yes, is? Yes, it is. It's the uh, one from the Golden Buddy Pack. The one that's like 15 bucks right now or something like that. And this card... Uh, this card has synergy, man. So uh, that card has always been a great staple. Mm -hmm. Its skill is when this card is destroyed by one of your uh, card effects, draw a card. So, so the now nice with thing the new is, item, you can draw two cards. Draw two. Very, very good. Very good combo. Very yes. good combo. And mm -hmm. I mean, it doesn't take that big of a hit to its stats either. No, and it's simple. it doesn't. It's very simple. Quite nice. Quite nice. And then... This guy. I feel like that one was a promo as well. I might be wrong on that. No, I remember pulling him. I think he was like common or an nah. uncommon from one of the sets. I don't want to say triple D era. Maybe 100 era. Pretty decent. Next. Still decent. Still decent. So obviously, you have to run this card. Ah, I forget the name, though. It's Purgatory. Knights Forever? Yes. Is it? No. I it's Purgatory. Well, that should be right. Make sure it's the right card. 
Yeah, that's Purgatory Nights Forever. Which was Simple. a promo originally. Um, which had like Tsuku on it, I remember. No, yeah. you got it in a set. Nope, that's where. Okay, okay. Black Dragon Shield. Mm. No, no, Tsuku art. No. Or Just... should I say Purgatory Knight art? Yeah. Uh, Next one is a uh, draw spell. It's a uh, when you are dealt damage, or maybe it's just when. No, I'm pretty sure it's when you're dealt damage. Draw a card. Then if you have a Purgatory Knight's monster on the field, draw another card. Mm. It's solid. So much kind for of nice situational one. though. So much for a nice one. Because most of the times they're going for your monster no, anyway. Crush that body and sustain yeah. mine. Uh, when a Purgatory Knight's monster on your field is destroyed by one of your card effects, gain a gauge, and then it's got a revive skill. Mm. When uh, your life hits zero, destroy it and reveal the top card. If it's a spell, your life becomes three? Is it two or three that they typically do? I want to say it's three. Uh, three seems very odd. It would either be two or one. It might be two. Or it's, five. <laughs> it's two or three. Um, next we got their old school weapon. I want to say it gained a crit yes. if your uh, center monster was destroyed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it was a once per turn thing though. Well of course, you can only destroy your center so many times. Then we got the original Distortion Punisher. OG Distortion. Only a one, though. Yeah, but then here's the one of Damios, though. The one of Damios Impact Monster. Mm. And then, uh, of oh course... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Of course. Oh my gosh. Everybody. Let's see if it focuses. This is all that matters. Damios, Damios SD. SD. Where's the actual card? Where's the actual card? Nobody cares about this guy. It's this guy right here. This guy right here. Well, yes, that's the Darkness Dragon World flag that they get here. Yeah, quite nice, nice. Quite nice. You ready to go over some of the goodies? Some of the goodies? Let's go with this Well, yeah, you, you have this amazing carrying case. Yeah, absolutely. Very, very it's good. nice. Very good. Really nice, shiny. Shiny. Should last you a while. What we got here? I'm opening the little packet that came with it. Uh, we have a... Yes, don't, yeah. don't put it upside down. Life counter for I'll her turn the, I'll take the other one. All right, I guess. I do kind of like the whole double image type go. Um, backside there. Um, let's see, does it do the new typical 12? No. It does. Goes to the 24. It's nice, nice. Still a little stiff, obviously, since it's brand new. These are also usable over here, which is nice. Yeah, because... They're just life counters, and they're nice ones. I don't know what this is. It might be a promo, or like, exchange coupon thing, or might just be a... Oh, it's probably rules. I don't know. Like, flow of a turn. I'm not going to even attempt to read that. Yeah. So, uh, next we have a little flyer. Ooh, I like this one already. Uh, and uh, it's pretty clear what it's meant for. So it's tipped at the back of most... Um... So we got... Let me put it like this that side, some uh, looks like some manga panels. Manga panels here. Kind of. Flowed. Why don't you uh, just looking at the pictures, Dalton? Give us a summary of it. All right, let me just. I'm gonna have to flip it around on y'all. <clears throat> GB Panda wants to learn how to play buddy fight. Goes up against Baku using a Thora. Jumping up, looking pretty strong. Bots comes out on the field. GP Panda equips an item. They go ham. He blocks it. <laughs> um, GP Panda gets really teed off and goes at it again. And then Gal jumps into the game and hit him with the impact. Neat. Yeah. Very, very straightforward. Let's make sure it's all in there. And then the reverse side. There's something interesting there, too. Oh, in reverse? No, no, okay. no. no, no. <laughs> oh! What? Man, what is... Is this... It's an advertisement for the uh, trial deck, the, the start deck, yeah. start deck, start deck. Interesting. Interesting. I, you know, when I first saw it with Gal on it, I was expecting it to advertise the other double deck. You know, the uh, yes. fifth army and hundred demons, but mm. no. Hmm. Interesting. Quite neat. Quite neat. Yeah. So uh, onto the actual cool stuff. Oh. 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 You want to go for the really cool thing? The thing All we've right. never seen before. Yes. This. We might have to zoom out on the camera. Maybe. Just because of how... Oh, there's something. This is quite nice. Actually, you know what? Let's see if we... I want to hold this end down for me, good sir. All right, let's see. 
Look at that. Christian's coming over for the assist. You got a two-person play mat. And I saw something funky on the back. We will get to but that. First but first do I do like this. I, I like kind of like seeing it just because, you know, they're not in English, which is mm -hmm. neat. Plus, Ma maybe we what never we should get do, the dual ones. Maybe what we should do is get this completely laminated <laughs> and use it. It'd save us some time. Maybe. Maybe. But, and let's check out the back. So, okay. Oh. Okay. okay. Are you ready? I don't think we're ever going to get to laminate this. Nope. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. All yeah. right. That's pretty nice looking. That's a good poster. That's a good poster. Just gonna say it. But you see on this other side here, you know, you know, you know. There you go, Jackie. Beautiful, beautiful poster of Tasuku himself. Quite nice. Quite yeah. nice. So we've got two more things to show off. Two more things. All right, we can probably zoom back in now. Maybe. So we got sleeves. Take a set. Mm. So, we don't need uh, to open them though. Uh, not really. Just right. Percher and uh, Damien. It's not surprising that they're those two, but they look nice. Let's make sure. And uh, I can tell even through the packaging, they're standard, you know, Bushy Road nice sleeves. The good ones they make, which are excellent sleeves. Let's check. Silver, silver backing, obviously. Hmm. Quite nice, quite nice. Too bad they don't come with over sleeves. <laughs> need over sleeves. All right, well, uh, you got anything else you'd like to uh, say? I'm taking these sleeves, Jackie. Wow. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. Um, pretty cool. May if you guys want us to do more things like this, importing a Japanese exclusive item, let us know down in the comment section below, because I wouldn't mind doing that. It, yeah, it seemed like it'd be neat. quite fun. Um, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the bell to get the notifications, though. And if you think Demios is the better oh, Tsuku okay. buddy. If we're going to go that way. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. whoa. If you think Demios is Tsuku's better buddy, I want to see a one in the comments. But if you think it's um, th this this guy right here, I, you, you can leave a three. What's two? Uh, and two? I don't think you're ready for this. Two for bots. As, as Tsuku's buddy? Yes. Okay. For, right. Foreshadowing. Foreshadowing. If you keep up with the <laughs> subbed anime. Well then. Um, goodbye. See you next time. There you go, guys. A little better image of that. Ugh. And we'll end on that. We want to thank our sponsor, Frost Giants Games, for making this show possible. Frost Giants Games is Wisconsin's game store of choice for board games, Magic the Gathering, and other card games. Check them out at www.frostgiantgames.com.